Oh, hi everyone. I'm Chi Zewen from Beijing Institute of Technology. Today, I'm going to introduce our paper.、Uh, can monolingual pre-trained models help cross-lingual classification?、Uh, this work is done during internship at Microsoft Research.、Uh, we know that training data for test classification are imbalanced across languages. Most training data are only available in rich resource language, and such as English. It requires great efforts to make this data available in low resource languages. Multilingual pre-trained models have shown surprising cross-lingual transferability on downstream tasks. By learning examples in a rich resource language, the multilingual pre-trained models can directly perform the learned task in other languages. However, for models with fixed number of parameters, the model capacity per language decreases if we add more languages. It can be found that multilingual models usually perform worse than monolingual models on downstream tasks. Look at this table. We compare the multilingual models and monolingual models on two classification tasks in English. It can be found that the monolingual models outperforms multilingual models. So we raise a question that can monolingual pre-trained models help cross-lingual classification? Before answer this question, let me first introduce monolingual multilingual language model fine tuning. This figure shows a typical procedure of multilingual fine tuning for cross-lingual classification. The multilingual Pre-trained language model is first fine-tuned on training data in source language, and then evaluated on test data in target languages. Then we propose a our method, our a multilingual fine-tuning method called Mono X, based on the teacher-student framework. We set a monolingual teacher and a multilingual student in our method. The monolingual teacher first learns the end task skills and then teaches the multilingual student. So the end task knowledge is transferred from monolingual teacher to the multilingual student. In this figure. We present the fine-tuning procedure of Mono X. We first fine-tune a monolingual pre-trained language model on the source language training data. Then we use the resulting monolingual teacher cl classifier to train the student classifier. Then this can be achieved by creating pseudo labels or knowledge distillation. Finally, we evaluate the multilingual student classifier on the test data in target languages. In our experiments, we use two data sets. One is cross-lingual sentiment data set.、Uh, it contains Amazon reviews in three domains and four languages. Uh, the other one is the cro cross-lingual natural language inference dataset, or called XNLI.、Uh, it contains dive and test sites in fifteen languages, and the training site in English. For the pre-trained language models, we select multilingual BERT or MBERT as the student model. And Robota Large as the teacher model. We compared our method with two baseline models. Mbert means directly fine-tuning fine-tuning 
I'm Bert with the English training data. I'm Bert ST means fine tuning I'm Bert by self training. In other words, alternately fine tuning I'm Bert and、uh, updating the training data by labeling English and labeled examples. In this table, we report the accuracy scores of zero sort cross-lingual sentiment classification on the CRS dataset. It can be observed that our method outperforms baseline models in all languages and the, the domains. Besides, we can see that the self-training method only slightly improves the MBIRT, which demonstrates that. The performance improvement of our method mainly benefits from the anti-task anti-task knowledge transfer rather than the unlabeled data. Also, we can observe、uh, similar results on the cross-lingual natural language inference dataset. In this table, it shows that our method performs better than the two baseline models. We study the effect of training data size.、Uh, we fine tune the models with different training data size and keep other the other hyperparameters fixed. From the figure, we observe that when training data is re- relatively small, our method it provides great improvement. We also study the effect of knowledge distillation temperature. We observe the best accuracy score when the temperature is at、uh, 0.1. Thank you.